Alright, back with Final Fantasy V, the blind playthrough. Let's uh, try and find this Karnak place. So, I've been wandering for a bit, and I don't know where the fuck to go. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go back into walls and see if anyone can actually give us a clue. Found a wounded soldier from Karnak and brought him back to the palace. He's resting in the guards' barracks. Alright, so let's go to the barracks. Let's see if we can talk to this fuck. Is the barracks this way? That must be the guy. Investigating the meteorite that fell near Karnak when I was suddenly warped here. Okay, so... Maybe I need to go to the meteorite since he was warped here? Okay. That seems like a good clue to me. Literally the first two people I talked to. <laughs> That's all I had to do. All I had to do is talk to the first two people I saw. And we can now proceed with the story. Holy shit. Alright, let's uh... Let's go to Karnak then. I feel really, really dumb. Yep, here we go. <laughs> that makes me feel kind of dumb, but, you know, I think the older Final Fantasies, they don't hold your hand um, that hard. Because I remember playing, I remember playing Final Fantasy 3 on the DS, and I actually had to look up where to go, because I was literally, I was literally had no clue where to go at all. So... What I had to do was, I was stuck in this, uh, gold, gold-like palace thing for a while. Because, like, my boat was, like, anchored or some shit. And literally, how I got through it was, um, you, ne you needed a key to open up a door. But I couldn't find the key. But also, thieves can pick-lock the doors, I, f uh, I read on the internet, so I just chose the thief class and there I was able to open doors and proceed with the game. So yeah, that was pretty fun. That was a pretty cool memory. So anyway, we're not talking about Final Fantasy 3, we're talking about Final Fantasy 5 and we are now in a new area. Let's see what these dogs have. Potion, okay. Let's not waste any more time trying to steal from these fucks. So it looks like we are, we are finally presuming the story. Off screen, I, I literally went around for a whole hour off screen like, where the fuck do I go? <laughs> I literally went to every corner I could possible because the dragon can't fly over the mountains and stuff like that. So I literally just flew aimlessly for a good hour. So I was like, alright, let me just um, turn this game off and... not do anything for a bit. Couldn't steal, of course. And then, uh, I came back and I was like, you know what, we should probably go back to Walls. Surely someone would know give us a slight clue. And behold, first, first goddamn try, we got, uh, <laughs> first two people we talked to. Wow, 5 HP dream, by the way. First two people we talked to, they just perceived the game, so that's pretty cool. Uh, I'm not sure if I want to waste my time trying to steal, because stealing is very hard to do in this game for some reason. Which means to me that stealing can be useful, and you can get really good stuff from it, but again, we don't know... It's, a, it's my blind playthrough, so I have no clue what you can get from these guys. Unless I just sit here for like hours trying to steal. And I don't know the steal rate. I'm, I'm, I'm assuming it's pretty fucking low. Because, uh. I didn't get a single steal in that. 
Gold toe shell, though. That must have been from the turtle. Uh, let's up, go up here. Encounter. Got these turtle friends. Uh, let's heal. Galoof back to full. It's so cool having a healing rod at this point in the game, because um, it's basically a basically an X potion for early game because it heals more than a potion, heals more than a probably a high potion as well, heals more than cure, even though cure I can cure all. Except uh, curing all doesn't really do a lot, <laughs> to be honest. Right, last last time we did cure all, I think we in, uh, raised our HP by 50. <laughs> 50? Uh, looks like they drop turtle shells quite often, so that's cool. Alright, nothing up here. Maybe there's something actually in that grass if I went on a certain pixel, but I don't know. Alright, zoo by itself. Maybe maybe it's a good opportunity to actually try and steal from this fuck. So we're just gonna I'm gonna sit here and steal from it until we finally steal something. Cause I feel like the zoo might give us something pretty useful. Elixir! Okay, that was, um... I guess worth it, maybe? I, that did take me almost 10 minutes to get. Um, so I'm not sure if that's actually worth it. I was hoping for a weapon. So you can farm elixirs here if you want, but it took me 10 minutes to steal one, so probably wouldn't recommend it. Unless elixirs are hard to get for a reason. But yeah, this early in the game you get elixirs, that's pretty that's pretty cool, I suppose. But I probably wouldn't recommend it because it took me ten minutes to steal one. <laughs> so I probably wouldn't do it again. There must be there must be an item later on to raise the chances of stealing because this is this is kind of ridiculous. The steal rate in this game is super low. Oh. S someone learned a job level and learned Chakra. I think that's a monk. That's for Galoof, I think. I was just spamming A. But yeah, I feel like I feel like the steal rate is super low for a reason, because I feel like you can get some uh, broken stuff. Um, early or late game. Potentially. That, that's zero damage though. I need to heal Ferris big time. Might as well use some potions. Oh. <laughs> Look who's back! Alright, I'm not gonna actually go for the steal this time. I'm just gonna attempt to steal the elixir, but I'm actually going to um, just kill it. But hopefully I'll get an elixir, but I very much doubt it, because it took me 10 minutes to steal one. So. And that's the counter attack. He still lives, though! He still goddamn lives. Fuck. Zoos have uh, quite a lot of HP, it looks like. Alright, let's, uh, let's give it a quick save. And let's uh, move on. 
Here we are in Karnak. This is where we're supposed to go. Locked, so we can't buy any new magics. How unfortunate. The in option. Uh, how much is for an in? Twenty. Might as well get a full heal for twenty gil. Why not? I'm not too worried. And is this guy selling items? Uh, just your basic stuff. Mm. Just your basic stuff. We, we've seen we've seen all those items already. Nothing too crazy. Got got many fires going on though. Many fires. Might as well uh, have a look in the weapon shop while we're here. Uh, Mithril Knife already got, so we saved some gil. Mithril Sword... Uh, excuse me? Uh, do you know me? Do you know us? Hey, but we're not monsters though! Fuck you, no! They, they threw us in jail from crawling out of a rock, you serious? That fucking sucks, man. And I love how they're playing. It's playing the game over theme. <laughs> the, it's a game over theme for going into jail. Hell yeah. And uh, it looks like I can't get out. Let me out. I do not belong here. There's a guy that is looking at a wall. Maybe he's insane. Oh, he's coming to my rescue. Oh. <laughs> Alright. Alright, <laughs> What's so funny, boy? That's pretty much what I said in the nutshell. Ah, the Sid. This is Final Fantasy V Sid. Isn't there a Final Fantasy that doesn't have a Sid? I can't remember. I haven't played all of them. I, mean, I haven't played one or two. Or this one. But I... Pre I'm pretty sure there's, there's a Sid in every single Final Fantasy. Correct, correct me if I'm wrong. So, uh, the people here are... Uh, Possessed, or some shit, or just want to see the world burn, or some shit. Yes, we are the warriors of light. Sparkle, 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 sparkle. Oh, that's what he was uh, showing. I, 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 was, I was wondering what he was trying to show. Just something sparkly. Here, I have a hand that sparkles. Uh, have you guys come to your senses now?
Yes, but we come too, because we're the Warriors of Light and stuff like that. Ah, oh, shit, we let the werewolf out, didn't we? Ah, fuck, that's gonna bite us in the asshole, isn't it? Shit. I can't help if they can't help. Uh, yeah, we're the Warriors of Light, after all. Alright, can I actually go shop now without being ins rudely interrupted? Alright. Uh, I doubt there's anything in your room. I see a chest up there. That I can't get into because there's conveniently there's fire in the way. And someone's already raided these chests. Fucking, are you serious? Some asshole raided these chests already? And then this chest I can't get because it's fire in the way again? Ugh. That's bullshit. Wow, that... That fire's being a dick. Just being in the way of all the treasure chests. Fuck you, game. And that one too? Wait. Get out of my way. Oh, come on, you serious? I I can't get any treasure chests because the fire's conveniently in the way. That's uh, some horse cheat. This guy dying in bed. Can't, we can't even go through these doors because there's fire conveniently in the way. Yep. <laughs> Fuck. And there's fire conveniently in the way here and here. Alright, so. Looks like we are not going anywhere. Ah, the werewolf. And what I mean by we're not going anywhere is we're not getting any items until we proceed with the game. Game's been a troll. Fucking give me items. That's all I want. Cool. So, before we go into that ship, let's actually get some stuff. Let's actually buy some shit then. Anyway, I already. I, I did buy the Mithril Sword. Alright. Mithril Hammer, I don't need that because no one can uh, hold it. Flame Rod, rather sometimes cast Viraga. But I don't have a Black Mage. I mean, I know we can change jobs at any time, but still. Um, well, you can't change jobs in the midst of battle, obviously. Um, okay, so I could buy these rods, but we're going into a fireplace, so I feel like fr the frost rod's the way to go, and since we already have one, I'm not going to waste money on rods I don't need. Mithril shield, might as well buy one. Mithril hell, already got one. Plumed hats, might as well get three. Mithril armor, yep. Silver plate. Two. Silk Road already got one. Mithril Glove. Uh, but does it do anything more than just Forge from Mithril? I, I get it's made from Mithril. It probably raises my defense by a little bit. But does it do anything more than that? Silver Armlet. So, so I've, I've got a silver armlet, right? And it says shiny and effective. Uh, optimize. Like, see? This silver armlet, it... It's better than leather shoes, I'll give it that. It raises my defense by one point, and my magic defense by two, but... 
does it do anything else other than raise my stats a little bit? Because I don't want to waste my time buying a mithril thing when I can have this that prevents my prevents darkness, you know? Alright, let's uh, optimize. Uh, no. Optimize. All right, let's sell some cheese. So, we don't need a Mithril knife anymore. Power drink, I'll keep. Frost rod, I'll... I'll keep a frost rod. Dagger, probably doing that crap. Ashura, no one can... How, how much does that sell for? <laughs> 2,900? Fuck. All right. I bet it's a really good... I bet it's a really good sword too, but I just um, can't equip it. Light robe, I'll sell. Diamond bell. Only 250? Fine. Um, should I sell that? Fuck it, I'll sell it. Shuriken's a throw weapon, so ninjas would be very good for that. Uh, Iron shield, don't need that anymore. Rod, don't need that. Long sword, I've got a mithril sword. Leather shield, I've got a mithril shield. I uh, don't need that. I've got silver plates, leather shoes, don't need that crap. Uh, healing staff. Uh, what, did, what does uh, Lena have equipped now then? Don't need leather hats, iron armor, don't need that. And that's everything. I prefer having healing staff on because it's a free heal if I need it, but Lena can't really do much. Sort. Uh, let's put the frost rod up on top. Uh, the only reason I'm doing that is because there might be. Let's put an elixir there. Okay. That looks good. Yeah, pretty much the other reason I'm putting the frost rod on top is because I'm not 100% sure, but um, in Final Fantasy 4 at least, if you click on a weapon, uh, it might have a secret thing where you can cast like magic from that weapon. So I'm hoping that I can still I can probably cast Blizzard Girl with the frost rod without using MP and stuff like that. Um, I'll see if that's actually a thing or not. I'm not sure. Uh, is, is the magic shop still closed? It's not. All right. There's three different people to talk to. Uh, level three black magic spells. I mean, I don't have um, a black mage, but I do have a mystic knight, which can do spell blade. And because we're about to fight a... Well, about to go into a fire ship. There's probably fire-based enemies. So Blizzard uh, might be useful here. So we'll just buy that. I'm not going to worry about Fire or Thunderer just yet. I'll see how my money situation is after I look at these guys. Kira, go buy that. Ray's go buy that. Um, Confuse. Don't want that. Silence. Don't want that. Protect. No shell, though. No shell. Uh, okay, so this is our time magic. I don't have a time mage, so all of this is useless, even though I've already bought haste and region before. I think I bought slow as well, but I can't remember. But I don't have a time mage, so yeah, that's completely irrelevant. So, because I have spare money, I might as well just buy Fire and Thunder as well. Just in case. You never know. Alright, anything else? Oh, the pub! Let's get fucking drunk! Is he really a bad guy? Probably, and it's all our fault. Fuck. Weapons and armor from Jackal are very strong. 
Okay, so we need to find Jackal very fast. I'm an adventurer from Jackal, but the road south to the Library of the Ancients is blocked, so I can't get home. Rat. Rat. That's why you're stuck here. Uh, not anymore, because uh, I proceeded the story a little bit. So basically, I need to get to Jackal to get some really good armor and stuff, but I bet it costs a shit ton. Piano skills leveled up. Alright. That, that must be some form of a side quest to get to master your piano skills to perform in front of the gorgeous ladies and stuff like that. Because, you know, girls drip over some piano, right? That's a lie, they don't. And we can't go up there because the fire is conveniently in the way. Although there's a... We can go to this house. You ever heard of a monster called Crudus? Once it's alone, it'll flash you. Look out. Alright, so if we ever fight a monster called Crudust, um, make it not be by itself because it will f put us in blind. Although, I think I have three characters that have the prevent blind thing on. Alright, guys, uh, should I continue? Nah, I, I don't want to do an entire dungeon and not know how long it's going to be. So I'm going to end things here. And next time we're going to go into this fire ship and save the fire crystal, hopefully. I'll see you guys there.